All right. Well, I wanted to come back here. You can barely see the truck back there. I wanted to come back here and share with everybody the two craters that are volcanic in nature. They're up at the top of that hill. Doesn't look like a hill, but trust me, it is. So we'll get our way up that way, get to the top, and then I'll show you around. All right, that little white speck is my truck. I think it's a mile and a half. We're here at the craters now. When you first come upon them, it's like just a hole in the ground. I don't know if this thing can do it any justice. So we're going to walk down there. That'll take us a minute. All right, getting up to the edge of the crater now. way down there. Holy crap. What is that? 100 feet? Let's walk out here. I have to be careful. Birds are singing. I hope you can hear that. Well, I don't know if there's a way down there. It's pretty steep. It may not look like that on camera, but yeah. If you look right here, you see that ledge there. That ledge is a good 30 feet, 25 feet at least. And then you got another ledge, and then it slopes. That's what it's like all around. I'm going to walk around this thing. There's another one over there. We're going to go try to find that one too. All right, well, I think that's got to be it. That one's got a trail going down into it. Woot woot, I have to check that out. All right, let's go see this. Yeah, there's a trail over there. I think I spotted another trail on that one over there. You can barely see the rim. They're really close together. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Oh, I have got an outcropping. Let's walk through here and see. There's like a dirt road. It's really a four-wheel drive road. I wouldn't take a vehicle up here unless you had four-wheel drive. High clearance. But uh, there's a couple of loops around these. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. We'll have to go check that out closer. You can see. Let me see if I can stop and zoom in on that. I hope you can make out the detail of that cliff. Let's get closer. Okay. Well, we came down. Now this is level. Uh, it's about level right there. And you can see that that's the ridge we just came down. That's a good couple hundred feet up there. So, steep. And then you come down here. And there's that 
Really cool looking rock formation on that cliff. And here's the crater. Looks like to be a little trail over there. This one's not as deep. Not at all. So we're going to walk over there to that rock formation, maybe. And then we're going to go back to the big crater. I did see a trail down into it. Let's see if I can't get down that. If it's not treacherous. Okay, we're on the other side of the large crater. You can almost see where the blowout was over there. We're going to climb up to the top of that hill and look in. That looks to be the highest point in the area, so up we go. Okay, we made it to the top. <coughs> now over there, you'll see the little road we came down the first and this is the first crater that's where we stopped and took some video and then over there that little dark spot is the other crater We're going to go up there and go around, do a full circle, come back over there. Spectacular. You can see the why he's off in the distance there. Not that far. Off we go. A long time ago, I remember saying something to David about, oh, the desert, it's ugly. Why would you want to go to the desert? <sighs> this is why. <laughs> it's so amazing. So you can't see the hill that we were on. We've already gone over another hill. But I did see how to get down into the crater. And I might do that. Let me show you something really pretty. Look at these little yellow flowers. Oops, dropped my water. Ah, it's so cool. Spring is springing. Ooh, what's that, a bone? Ooh, it is. Let me see. Oh, wow, that's a big bone, guys. <laughs> Holy moly. It's pretty bleached, so it's been out here a long time. Looks like a femur, based on the size. Wow. All right. So we have to go up that hill over there, and then another mile back to the truck. So the big crater is right here in front of us. And I'm going to come down this road here and see if we can't walk into the crater. It looked like there was a washout there. And I saw tracks. So that must be how folks got in there. All right. Oh, there's a car down there. A little white car. Make it down the hill. Looks like a bunch of people and little puppers. All right, see you in a few minutes. All right, that definitely is the way to get in. But I'm not gonna do it. 
trying to take this ridiculous trail right here. Okay, <laughs> that's the hill, the big hill that we climbed. It's the other little hill we climbed. Just came up from over there. Cute little path. It was fun, kind of getting me ready for Utah, actually. It was a nice little scramble. Next time I come up here, I'm going to come down this way first and then go down into the crater. So far, I'm at 3.6 miles and I know I'm at least one mile, maybe a mile and a half from the truck, so, but I think the rest of it's downhill. <laughs> after we go up that hill. All right, see you in a minute. All right, up on top, you can see the other one over there. We did a big loop. You can see the mountains over there. Mountain homes right behind us. That's, uh, I'm not sure, are those the white clouds? Something range, I don't remember. And there's my truck way off in the distance. See you there.